this a little bit full. <laughs> Hello, makers. I'm gonna take a little sip here. Mm. Oh, it's been another wonderful December day. I thought I would do a nice little summary chat and kind of break the seal on this option for Vlogmas this year. I hope that you've been enjoying it. My heater just went on because it is so cold. I actually have one of my blankets <laughs> with me down here on the floor. I wanted to have a little bit of a festive background as I open up today's advent calendars. I have my fake fireplace going. You can see it's 5.43 p.m. <laughs> It's very dark. It's been very dark all day today. It's been raining non-stop, which has been lovely and cozy and much needed. I've been doing lots of little things here and there, but um, it's been really nice to have this weather once again come around this time on a weekend where I could be at my own pace and slow down a little bit. It's always probably the first... I want to say five days of December are still really hurried and still feel a lot of that tension between naturally wanting to slow down and start to usher into winter time versus kind of the cultural pace of everything. But I'm feeling a little bit more hopeful and optimistic. I think many people are really hopefully feeling that way of seeing the the holiday, true holiday, slow down uh, light at the end of the tunnel. So that's exciting. But today I've just been really, um, after doing some stitching the high notes work this morning and getting some orders off into the mail, just been chilling out and trying to recoup and restore. I'm going to do that a little bit more here now. I've poured some chamomile tea. I might take another little sip here. And I might knit a little bit, but honestly, I really wanna play video games. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna do that after I chat with you all. So let's open some Advent minis here. Mm. I hope that you've been enjoying Vlogmas so far. I have really, really enjoyed and felt, I keep saying reinvigorated, but feel really inspired by having this real focused intention with what I want to share with you all each day. So it's been really joyful and really fun. So speaking of joyful, yarn time. <laughs> so first up, I have shared that I have three advent calendars, one, three advent calendars with yarn minis specifically. The first one I purchased um, from Sweet Sparrow Yarns. I've always wanted one of her advent calendars. She's one of my favorite indie dyers since I started knitting. So I've really loved it. Um, and let's open today's. Love her packaging as well. Hopefully you can see everything with the, with the lighting, the ambiance of the holiday lighting. <laughs> I tried to do this before the sun went down, but it actually was so dark that I was like, I might as well just do it at night. <laughs> so let's see. I love the envelopes. Oh, so pretty. Oh, it's got a stitch marker. A little snowflake. And it's a really pale lavender and it looks like it's on one of her sparkly bases oh so so pretty i love that the minis and they're 10 gram minis it looks like i'll have to confirm to look but oh it's such a sweet stitch marker beautiful beautiful i love that the minis are on different bases which is really beautiful i'll put the name of this colorway down on the screen if I haven't already. Gorgeous. The next one is actually a swap that I did with my pal, my friend, longtime collaborator, Gabby of Plies and Hellhounds Yarn. Um, and her theme is um, uh, mythology. I need to honestly read up more on it, but it is just, the yarn has been 
gorgeous so far, not surprisingly. Um, so we did a swap. I sent her one of my cross-stitch uh, holiday boxes that I did this year for my shop. Um, and she sent me one of these beautiful yarn advent boxes. So I love the washi tape that she's had. Let's open this up. Ooh, really, really beautiful. Very similar. It's interesting. I don't know if you've been noticing kind of similar colors to Julie of uh, Sweet Sparrow Knits, just in terms of the the base color. But this is like a brown, a little bit of a mauve colorway. It looks variegated a little bit gorgeous oh and i love this base is so soft so so soft so beautiful and these are uh 20 gram minis and i am going to cast on the shawl which i shared yesterday i did download the pattern you got a pattern code with the um for for it to be free with the admin box i'm looking at it over there um, but it is available for purchase. It's a really cool shawl, and I thought maybe I don't want to do the fringe, but I think I'm going to do the fringe. It'll be a nice kind of retro, kind of cozy shawl. So I do want to cast this on very soon. As I said, probably in the next couple of days because I'm in the home stretch of uh, a pretty packed schedule here. <laughs> but, oh, so, so pretty. Okay. And last but not least, I have Trilogy Yarns, and this once again was a swap uh, because I collaborated with Nancy this year as well. I made bags for her um, advent boxes, um, and the theme for the advent boxes was uh, the TV show Shit's Creek. So some of you eagle-eyed when I shared the colorway names on the ball bands for the yarn were like, hey, ew, David, yes. That is correct. <laughs> so let's see. These are so fun. I love Nancy's colorways. Let's see here. Day three. Oh, I love it. This beautiful blue. Looks like there's pops of green in there a little bit. You can see. Oh. And what's the color name? Tweet us on Facebook. <laughs> I have to admit, I have not gotten past the first season of Schitt's Creek, I know, but I really, really want, especially getting this inspirational yarn and making all of the bags was, I was like, I need to, I need to watch the show, but I feel like I kind of have because there's so many quotable scenes that have been shared and it's just been starting to be really ingrained in the culture and brings pure joy to everybody so oh so lovely so here are today's another 20 gram skein oh i love this sweet stitch marker too so here are today's minis <laughs> as i said i'm gonna play some video games to round out the night and probably hit the hay pretty soon i've been waking up very very early just naturally um so about like seven o'clock I'm ready to go to bed <laughs> I think I just am in full hibernation mode and I'm embracing it as much as I can so cheers to you all I will see you tomorrow bye